The Mortuary Workers Association of Ghana is embarking on an indefinite strike effective today in demand of improved conditions of service. Concerns of the union include inadequate provision of personal protective equipment, leaving workers exposed to diseases and hazards. Additionally, salary arrears dating back to 2020 remain unpaid and the request for financial clearance to employ 500 additional mortuary workers has been ignored. General Secretary of the Mortuary Workers Association of Ghana, Richard Kofi Jordan, tells Channel One News mortuary workers will not return to work until they are demand. My colleague Fred Duho has been monitoring the situation and has come through with the following. The Mortuary Workers Association of Ghana has declared an indefinite strike. They are basically making demands on government for a better condition of service. Among their demands, one is that their arrears has been uh, unpaid for over four years now. And again, they are asking for clearance to employ some 500 additional workers. Again, they say the PPEs they use are just not helping their work and so they are vulnerable to certain diseases and conditions of illnesses and so these demands are among the reasons why they've embarked on an indefinite strike. Here at the Kolibu Mortuary it is quite obvious that they have a red cloth tied to the main entrance and the gate is also closed to the general public. This would mean so much for people who are expecting or preparing to take their relationship.